they uh, switched this pivot. It looks like they switched this pivot to a Torx on the uh, Microtech Whale Shark, which I'm sure everyone will appreciate. This one has the CTS-204P blade steel. I don't know if they're going to be using that more, you know, if they'll be making more. This is a standard grind whale shark. I've seen the 204P in the chisel ground, but I hadn't seen this. This one's stonewashed. When I saw the standard grind uh, with the 204P, by Carpenter Steel, uh, I had to get it. It's kind of a weird knife, it really. I mean, the handle is really skinny in this dimension. This way, tall, I guess you'd call it. Especially considering the size of the blade. Um, a lot of people have commented on that, and it really is. The, the blade to handle ratio is good, you know, so that's good. And it, because it's kind of thin, the, I find the grip is a little bit lacking. Uh, my main gripe, however, is the pocket clip, uh, which I've heard a lot of people talk about. It's, uh, it's actually sharp and it actually hurts, hurts your hand. It's going to have to be remedied for me to use it properly. The uh, Maybe bend it down like a plateau like the Spyderco Hourglass clip or uh, grind it down or something, but it's uh, very uncomfortable. The rest of the hardware is the standard Microtech um, fair, weird drivers. Uh, PSD Products makes drivers for these Microtech, these weird Microtech uh, fasteners, and uh, I'll see, I'm going to see if they make make one for this particular head. Then I would have be able to do whatever I want with it because of the Torx. That's a big Torx. It's bigger than the military, so it's got to be pretty big. 20 maybe, 25. I don't know. Flips out good, good and fast. There is some inconsistencies in the bearing system as you go, but uh, pop it out with the thumb stud. A little different, you gotta kinda put your thumb on the blade behind it. And it's still a little slippery, but it, it works pretty good. Or you can open it slow with the thumb stud. It's definitely a really nice knife, off-center. I'm hoping to fix that once I get the tools. I might even be able to just adjust this pivot pin, you know, the pivot screw and, and, and fix that. No blade play, no wobble, really solid. Overall, a nice knife. So, just a quickie, I'm uh, standing on the side of a ski slope, which looks quite a bit, uh, looks quite a bit steeper than it does when you're flying down it in the winter time. But this is just a little mountain uh, that's, that's local here in upstate New York. But uh, yeah. Just wanted to shoot a quick video. Uh, thanks for watching, guys, and we'll uh, see you on the next one.